Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. What if I guess today is something a bit different? Now, if you guys didn't know earlier today, Black Ops 2 was announced to be backwards compatible on Xbox One. Now, this is only on Xbox One. Unfortunately, it is not on PS4, which kind of sucks if you don't have both consoles or if you're not on Xbox One and you only have a PS4. But if you do have an Xbox One, you can actually play Black Ops 2, which is really, really nice. Uh, the only thing about it is you're still going to be playing against people from Xbox 360. And I'm sure you guys know that playing on old gen consoles, a lot of, you know, hackers, a lot of glitchers, a lot of modders are still around. So it might be a little bit annoying, but if you are still down, uh, you know, to play Black Ops 2 on your Xbox One, it's really, really simple. The only problem is a lot of people don't know how to really get it and how to download it. Um, because for some people, it shows up in the store and some people it doesn't show up. So I'm going to show you guys the way I downloaded mine and I downloaded mine pretty quickly. Um, I had no issues. I know some people are saying it's taking them like a few hours to download it. I'm pretty sure I downloaded mine in like 20 to 30 minutes. So it was really, really quick. Anyways, if you guys do enjoy this video or find it helpful, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe for more videos and let's get right into this. The first thing you want to do when you are online on your Xbox One is hard reset your Xbox. What I mean by that is hold on, um, you know, on the Xbox, there's the lighting button. Pretty much hold it for, I think it's five to like eight seconds and your Xbox should completely turn off, turn it back on. And that will pretty much, uh, I, I don't know what it really does, but I guess it puts like, you know, Black Ops 2 backwards compatible on your Xbox if it's not showing up for you in the store. I know that works for a lot of people. And that's the one thing I had to do in order to download mine. Anyways, once you do that, all you have to do is go to your store on your Xbox One, which is located all the way up top. Go to the search box and type in Black Ops 2. Really simple, Black Ops 2. I'm pretty sure you have to spell it out completely. You can't just say, uh, you know, BO2. You have to actually say Black Ops 2. Uh, but once you search it, it will be, I think, the third game to the right, or it might be the first one as soon as it pops up. Now, as I said, if you search that in your Xbox store and the game doesn't come up, you have to hard reset your Xbox again and just pretty much keep resetting it till it actually shows up because like I said, it's it's a going on issue. I don't know if it's a bug or if it's meant to be like that. So, uh, you know, not everyone downloads the game at the exact same time and possibly crash the servers or anything. Uh, so like I said, all you have to do is keep resetting your Xbox. Once you do that, it will show up and all you have to do is either buy it either download it again. I know I had it on the 360, so the only thing I really had to do was download it again. It's around 16 gigabytes, like 16 something, so um, it, it's not too big of a file. Now, if you do have to purchase it, it is around $20, and I'm not sure if this is true or not, uh, but a lot of people are saying that when they purchase the game through Xbox One, it's taking forever to download it. Like, it's going really, really slow. I'm not sure if this is just, once again, a bug, or if it's meant to be like that. I'm not really too sure. Uh, maybe it's just because there's a ton of people downloading it, but that's pretty much how you get Black Ops 2 on Xbox One. It's really simple. Oh, and really quickly, if you have the disc, all you have to do is put in your Xbox One, and I'm pretty sure there's like a small update you have to do um, in order to actually be able to play it, and pretty much you will be able to get on the game and play multiplayer. Now, the only thing that sucks about it is there's no league play as of now. Uh, there's only like private matches and there's only multiplayer. Uh, so for anyone, you know, that is looking to play league play, unfortunately, there is no league play on Xbox One. Anyways, that's it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section below. But once again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.